people. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. We had a beautiful day. Did you have a beautiful day? Yeah. Yeah? I'm sorry, I came home and realized that you guys are leaving. We had a very beautiful, hectic day. And what, what Brian means by he he came home and realized that we're leaving is because we are going to Virginia. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yep, we are going to Virginia. We are going to go see my baby brother in college and we're going to go see his first home game with UVA. We are so excited. But it's been a hectic day because this little person that we know, her name is Riley decides that she doesn't believe in sleep she doesn't know what sleep is you know sleep is not really her thing and uh little miss riley if you follow me on instagram yes if you follow me on instagram little miss riley was up at three o'clock in the morning and she thought it was time to play <laughs> You did not let mama sleep. You went back to sleep almost at five o'clock in the morning. Then you took a, then you went back to sleep and you took like a cat nap. And I thought that I was gonna get some sleep. No, what time did you wake up after that, Riley? After you went to sleep, what time? Seven o'clock. And then from seven o'clock, she was wide awake. No such thing as sleep. Are you excited? Are you so excited to go see Uncle Devin? Cricket. Babe, he's upset because that's a shot. He's upset because we are going without him. He cannot come with us because Mr. Brian has been. I'm sorry, he can't come with us. Dada has to work. Yeah, he has to work. I'm sorry. Go yell at him. Not me. It's not my choice. Okay. I'm glad you can forgive me. <laughs> God is so good because 2018 has really been bringing on blessings for us. 2017 was one heck of a roller coaster. And it brought the biggest blessing, but it was very, very hard for us. But 2018. <laughs> yes, it is. It's going to be amazing. Brian has been blessed with a promotion. Can you give me a bottle of water? What? <laughs> <laughs> you want this? Here you go. Uh -oh. You're gonna vlog? I feel like this is such a bad idea. You're gonna vlog? She's gonna, she's gonna just you like gonna eat it? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um. Brian got a promotion. God is so good. He knows we needed it really bad. And he's really excited. He loves it. Oh my gosh. I'm just going to give you the camera so you can vlog. So because he just started his new position, um, he will not be able to come with us to Virginia. But we're only going for like a day and a half. We're not staying out there too long because I'm going with my mom and she has to come back to work. So we are excited. But I wanted to show you guys something. I find it so crazy. I'm just going for a day. So I packed myself, you know, an outfit just in case we decide to go to dinner and then like an outfit to come back home and then an outfit to sleep. So this is my small bag. Got everything in there. But Miss Riley, why? Why do I why does it feel like I have to pack for weeks? Let me show you Miss Riley's bag. This is her luggage. Now, I've never traveled more than two hours from home because we always travel to Philadelphia. So I've never traveled a whole day away from home where I needed to pack stuff because when we were in the hospital, they had everything. So let me show you guys real quick what I have here. I feel like I had to pack extra things because you just never know if she's going to have an explosive diaper or like I don't know. I just felt like I needed everything and I, I just want to pack her closet. So I have two things of Calmaceptin because this is the best booty cream ever. Ever. Riley 
wears like four onesies a day. So if I'm gonna be gone, I need to overpack. So I have like five short sleeve onesies and then like another three long sleeves. And then like, I don't know what the weather's gonna be up, like out there. I think it's gonna be like 70 degrees. <laughs> No, it's just, I don't, why is it so complicated? But anyways, then I have her, um, what are these called? You know, I'm a mom and I still don't know the names of these. The, uh, burp cloths. And then I have her bibs. No, these are burp cloths. Wouldn't be considered bibs? Um, sure. But anyways, we have, like, six pairs of pants. Maybe four, five. Nope, six. One, two, three, four, five. Six, yep, yeah, six pair of pants. And as you guys know, or maybe you don't know, maybe you haven't watched the vlog that I mentioned that I am no longer breastfeeding because my sad, sad friends dried out. So I am currently giving her Enfamil Premium. Now, I know this may not be the best formula out there. The reason why I chose Enfamil Premium is because this is the formula that they were giving her at the hospital when she was first born and my milk was taking long to come in. So her, I felt like her body was already used to the Enfamil and I didn't want to get her confused or used to something else that her body may not like so because we're traveling i ended up buying these and i think this is so cool because it's already prepped i just have to throw it in the bottle they're packets you know what this reminds me of when you have like your lemonade and you want to or your water and you have the lemonade yeah. sugar already packed and you just put it in the water that's exactly what this is this makes four ounces of milk which is perfect because that is all Riley drinks in a serving four ounces of milk we got Miss Riley her Cavaliers UVA onesie thank you to you know who who bought this for Miss Riley one of Devin's friends such a sweetheart he actually bought that for her um, out of the kindness of his heart and he got Miss Little Ready Little Virginia fan so excited Pampers I got a whole bag of Pampers which I'm gonna probably have to buy out there some more because Miss Riley poops a lot. Wipeys and in UVA the field, which is I kind of think is annoying because I'm a mom and I need to pack a lot of stuff for Riley when we're going out. They don't allow dark bags. You have to have a clear bag. And you if you want to bring in a bag, you can't bring like a book bag or a baby bag. You have to bring in a little clutch. Um, so I went to Walmart and I thank God that I found this. This bag is pretty awesome. It's actually pretty big. I got the unicorn because Miss Riley is my little unicorn. So these are the two things I'll be walking into the baseball fields with. And then we have another bag of her water. And as you guys know, I am making all of Riley's baby food. But what I am learning is how to store her baby food. Like, I don't know. I'm sorry. I worded that wrong. How to store it in a way that I can travel with it. So, huh? I did say it right? I guess I said it right. I'm trying, I'm trying to learn how to store her baby food in a way that I can bring it to long like distance locations and it not get bad and i'm thinking maybe like a lunch box with ice packs and stuff but i haven't fully done all my research on it and i don't want to do it and then it get messed up so what i did is um i bought pre-made baby food just because um i want i don't want to get her out of the habit of eating two meals a day from um like actual solids so um i really like beech nut natural baby food and i like what was the other one i think it's called here we go i have it here this is another one earth's best organic baby food um but today or tomorrow we are actually going to be doing beech nut she has just pear and blueberry can you see it yes we also have what love bug we have apple and pumpkin if it focuses hello boom and then I think the last one is apple and cinnamon apple and whoa apple and cinnamon so I'm doing um, she's another app uh, another blueberry and pear i bought her two of those because she loves blueberries and i figured let me give her um 
solids that she likes to eat especially since we're not close to home um, but I definitely need to learn so if you guys have any ideas any tips on how I can store baby food to travel with it homemade baby food please let me know because I work hard at making my baby food and I want her to eat my food only so I mean it's all right for now but if you guys do have any tips let me know but I'm going to end it here. I will see you guys tomorrow on our way to Virginia. Did I say that right? Virginia. No, it's Virginia. Virginia. I will see you guys in, in the car on our way to Virginia. Why are you clearing me this? I'm not going nowhere. I'm going to miss you. Lies. It's just a day. One day without us. <laughs> it's just one day without us. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. We'll see you tomorrow. Cavalier in and we're gonna see Uncle Devin. Are you so excited? Are you so excited? I don't know if I ever introduced my grandma, but this is grandma. Hey grandma. Hey. I think you guys met Ed before. And then you guys all know Riley. All right guys, let me get situated. We're gonna bring our stuff inside and I'll see you guys inside the hotel room. Hey. Stewatch! Stewatch, my baby! <laughs> so it is currently 319. Devin's game starts at 5. We're gonna relax, stretch our bodies out because we've been sitting in the car forever. And then we're gonna head to his game. We are so excited to see him. So, so excited! <laughs> Yeah! Are you happy to get out of the car? Yeah, you're so happy. And you guys know my mom. I came with my mom, my grandmother, and Ed. And then, of course, Ashwi. Oh my gosh! Are you so excited to be out the car? Hi! And it's a beautiful day, guys. It is absolutely beautiful. It's been like 40, 30 degrees out, and it's 78, 75 around there degrees out here in Virginia so it's nice to feel some nice warm air but we did keep Riley bundled because we don't want her getting sick with the change of weather hopefully I get to show you guys the game or some clip something you know what I will have my phone so that is less noticeable than a whole huge camera um but we'll see cuz I don't know like I have no idea I've never been to a professional college game so this is our first Extra base and indeed it will. Third hit of the game for Virginia. And a runner in scoring position with one out now for Devin Ortiz. How could I ever stay down when all you do is smile? As I'm looking at you hey. and I see the things you do. <laughs> yeah. I Girl, you are my strength. This little light of mine. Tell me how you shine. Tell me how you beat the eye. 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 Then he ate and then came to the hotel to hang out with us for a little bit. And then we found out he had a test that he had to continue studying for. So we had to bring him back to his dorm. Um, so now we're ready. It's a new day. 
and we're gonna go hang out with him for a little bit he's in class right now and then we're gonna head home because he has some meetings right he has meetings for the day so we can't really hang out with him for long we're probably gonna be heading home around like three right now it's 10 he gets out of class at 10 50. here he is who everyone was asking for the one that everyone thinks is funny here he is mr devin ortiz himself hello what's up I'm just showing good. the family around. Showing us around, yes. We're taking a little tour. Yeah. How's, it, uh, how's it out here, buddy? Oh, it's pretty good. I know I'm tall and all, but you make sure you don't cut off my forehead. <laughs> I can't. You're really tall, though. Oh, it's nice. We're uh, here at the rotunda on the lawn. You know, beautiful day. It's right. beautiful out here. Beautiful Mr. day. Riley. Riley's enjoying it, we think. I don't know. We think Not she's really. enjoying it. We don't really know. Are you having fun? Are you happy to see Uncle Devin? So how do you feel your team played yesterday? Uh, we played pretty well. Um, just oh. unfortunately, you win some, you lose some, you know? Win some, you lose some. So we're going to come back and then win, it, win the next one. The next strong. Well, we're going to miss you, dude. Thanks, bro. We got, we got to go back home and he has a... What do you have a meeting for? My academics. Nice. Once a week. Need make sure I'm on top of my thing. You know? Oh, 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 okay. Yeah. Oh. You know, no biggie. Oh, no big okay. Deal. Right. Stay on top of the books, you know. <laughs> so. Well, there you have it, guys. There's a uh, there's Devin, the one you guys love more than you love us. Thanks. Thanks so much. Darkest times. Now listen. Reach for the sky. The mission to break the night and fight for another day. This little light of mine shining. Better find some shade. Get rid of the hate, leave your heart feel joy. 